Tony Azegbebi, Edo State Chairman of People's Democratic Party, PDP, has said that the All Progressive Congress, APC, will not get 20% of votes cast in Edo North during the September gubernatorial election in the state. The PDP chieftain said that the perception of the former chairman of All Progressive Congress, APC, Adams Ushumole, in that zone was extremely low. He maintained that what was happening in Edo State as a whole had shown that the people were tired of Godfatherism. As Egbemi said, the reception that the campaign council is receiving from Edo North has been unprecedented. I am not surprised about what is happening because it goes to show that Edo people are tired of Godfatherism. I must say that I will not be surprised if APC does not get up to 20% of the vote cast in that zone during the September election. While reacting to the honor done Obaseki and his deputy Philip Shaibu by the Ugeneni of Uz Uzari, His Royal Highness Alaji Kadiri Omogbe, who gave the duo chief Tulsi titles and considering the fact that the area is the home base of Ushumole, as Igbeni said, the people are not happy with the kind of politics played by the APC and Ushumole, and that has played out in the way they have been supporting our party. Even though Ushumole came from that zone, the people of that district know that they want what they want and they are aware of the achievement of Obaseki as the governor. Edo people do not want any godfather. Okay? Well, if you say Edo people do not want uh, any godfather, some people still want. It's not everybody. You know, it now depends on the percentage. Of course, if Oshomole, let's say, for example, Oshomole is not going to get, or Ezeyam is not going to get 20% of votes from that zone, they might still cover up, you know, in other zones and all of that. And you cannot tell, you know, human being, until, until, until everything is being made open. You cannot even know their mind. People can be telling you, oh, oh, hey, you, all this and that, this and this. But within their hearts, they have a different uh, mindset. Don't be deceived by what people say. But let's see what comes up at the end of the day. But one thing I believe is that if he's not going to get votes in that zone because of what he has said, which is still debatable and it might not really be founded, in, they, will, might, they might make it up in other other zones where they have a uh, influence and one thing about this life is that one man's meat is another man's poison you might say you don't want god for some people will tell you that they want it they always say it's a good thing because some people believe in in what other people have done because some people like to depend on others some people do not even want to try on their own to do things but once they know that the the food is already ready mm, they just want to bring their spoon everything so might even bring shovel to come and eat with you but for them to prepare it no they just want somebody to go ahead and be doing it for them. So some people are like that, and some people just believe it, believe that I can do it, or they can do it by themselves. They don't even need to rely on people, and that is what is happening. It has de de degenerated in our environments and our country. People just want to get, just want to get. People don't even want to stress themselves. That's it. They just want a ready-made thing. So some people are in that category. So for you to make a, a categorical statement that say, oh, this might not be, this might not be, that is human being for you. You can't just predict them. Some people will tell you that Satan is even the best. Some people will tell you, oh, of course, who would have thought recently that uh, maybe we'll be having Church of Satan in the first place, even coming to Nigeria? Nobody will tell you that uh, he, he loves Satan. Nobody, even those who are traditional, uh, whatever, those who are idolaters, they won't even tell you. They don't even, <laughs> they don't even associate. I don't know, but uh, from my own point of point of view, those people they can't even associate with the devil. But now, what is the, the reverse is not the case. People building temple, you know, one is you know one of one of the example was what happened in one of the uh, Imo, uh, in eastern states in one of the uh, eastern states having a church of satan he built it and in this guy's guy was really helping them before they went to go and destroy it you know it's a different story altogether so one man's meat is another man's poison some people will tell you that they prefer to serve the devil so no matter how bad somebody is or a person uh is you they will still have their fans that is what has been going on in you know generally well with PDP chairman Anthony Azegbemi talking, reverse is the opposite. PDP will not get 20% in a do not. Okay, hmm. you are correct. I am from a do not. We are for Eze Yamu. 
matured politicians don't talk like this. It's obvious this guy is a baby politician. 20% from where Oshomole and the running mate to Pasosage Iyamu came from. Hmm, okay. Hmm, so it could be recorded that during 2019 general elections, Oshomole, as in then national chairman of APC, lost his word and polling units to PDP. What do you have to say about that? I can imagine. <laughs> Even that time, say, Katakata never boss so like this. So. Obaseki. You know, we just have to look at things holistically. You know, some people will say something and you're just like, oh, of course, this person is really making sense. But somebody will come and, and you know, with another counter argument and you just be surprised. Ah, I never thought, thought it this way. So that's why it's good for people to be objective and have an open mind. But a lot of people on social media these days, eh, once they feel that something is not just going to their, going their own direction, they will resort to abuse. That's it to say. Those people do not have anything to talk about. You know, when you bring an issue, Okay, talk about this issue. The next thing they will be telling you, your mama is this, your head is this, you are this and that. You know, all those when you think, you know that they, they need to go to a psychiatric hospital. Talk on the issue or base, you know, argue on the issue on ground. They will begin to insult you because they don't even know what to def what to say because they, maybe you have already swept them off, off the ground. So we have to be objective and be open-minded. Because we are not open-minded, that's why sentiment is always setting in. In most of the things we do, even when people respond, even when people react to things, you see that, you know that they're just responding based on sentiments. You know, some people are saying, how can this chairman says that uh, this and that, that uh, Oshomole and the running mate of Eze Yamu that came from that area will not get a 20%. Of course, it is logical when you say that. But some people say, okay, but during that 2019 uh, general elections, Obaseki was still with them. Um, it, 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 it was an APC state. Obaseki was there. What is this man's name? Um, Oishumole was still the national chairman. <laughs> it, it was a very, very, very strong force, and yet he lost in that place. So what does that tell you? Why did the people not just say, oh, irrespective whether we even want the president or we don't like the president, but because of our, of our, of our, of our son, the son of the soil, we are going to vote for 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 Buari, why did they not do that? Maybe you have a reason for that, but somebody's bringing that, bringing this point to us for us to be able to look. But some people will just say you forget about it. But it's 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 making sense. Well, um, bros, check properly. Oshomole's word APC scored ninety nine percent vote cast. So I don't know where you got your information from. Hmm. Okay, Oshomole is from Esako West, and APC had a. Uh, 31,366 why PDP had 11,393 during the last uh, election. Okay. Uh, someone says, Azek baby, politics is not your calling. Go and start rice business. Ha, I live in Chinese language. Your eyes go soon clear because we should more still remain the best performer performer in a do state. Someone says, hmm, work and eat. As your name indicates, you are really a parrot. Okay. R.I.P. to Azegbemi in a donut. Azegbemi in a donut election will be lost in your polling unit. Where are you from? Okay. Who is Azegbemi in a do politics? Look at who is talking. Are you PDP state chairman or PA to Dan Obi? Mm -mm. Can you imagine what this man is saying? Well, these are the that these are the opinions of people. So guys, let us hear your opinion. The man says that a uh, Obaseki. Or uh, is the APC will not get 20% votes from a donut. What do you think? Leave your comments below and let us know what you think.